Hello everyone, it's Dark Jedi Plays, and welcome to a first look here at the Halls of Torment. Uh, this is only the demo version of this game, although I do believe the full game is out, if not already, very, very soon. You'll be able to find the link to it in the description. Um, it's what happens if you cross Diablo 2 with an action roguelike, um, and I'm really excited to play it. Uh, I'm not sure if the graphics settings are right here, I'm going to check those in a second and come for, uh, come for you into the main video. But it is essentially, it's an isometric action roguelike with very nice pixely graphics. Um, and I've only got one hero I can choose from here, so we're going to choose them. Is he going to let me choose it? There we go, right, okay. I'm just going to double check all the settings and things and I'll be right back. Yep, that's all we could do there, that's fine. So, uh, you play as... Oh, this is my first character here. These things I know unlock things a little bit later. I actually caught someone playing this on Steam, uh, not Steam, on stream uh, a couple of hours ago. Figured, oh, I want to try a bit of this and it looked really good. So I'm going to give it a go. Let's go into it. Now, you're going to start seeing some things which are going to remind you of certain Diablo type games, if you like. I've turned on auto aim in the um, uh, in the settings because I really can't be bothered to have to hold down the attack buttons and things. There's a, a chest up here. Let's go and see if we can grab that. Obviously, the blue things there is XP. I need to get that to level up. When you level up, you get some stats. So, I can get 3% uh, base block chance, critical damage bonus, 8% range, or 40% pickup range. I'm going to go for 8% range, yes. Let's see if we can get some more level ups as we work our way up there. Need to be careful we're not getting surrounded by enemies. Because I haven't got any damage ups just yet. I just recovered some HP from something. There's another level up. Right, base defense, 8% area cone size. We will take that, thank you very much. Let's go this way. Right, so things in crates do drop. Can get things like gold. That turned into fire. Like fire. Ow, ow, ow. Didn't like damage. Fire is uh, semi persistent in it will do damage while it sits on the floor, which is quite nice. We like that. Want all this XP down here. Thank you very much. Uh, plus 10% damage. Sounds good to me. I want some attack speed at some point as well. I'll have to go round these guys. So you can get multiple types of attack. At least uh, I've seen a couple of different ones, um, which look quite interesting. Hello, loads of people died then. That was uh, nice. Give me that. I'm going to try and work my way up to that uh, thing that's up here. Regen. I'll take some regen. Certainly helped me because I have lost a bit of health, so... half expecting some cows to attack me at some point and if you get that reference me and you can be friends right so let's go get these dudes loads of gold that's nice walk over the fire walk over the fire oh, all right you will though <laughs> obviously they can be really good when you're being surrounded by things we are slowly making our way towards the chest Give me that gold. Thank you very much you'll notice there's one at the top of the screen and one at the bottom there's Metallic slimes, what are you? You're dead, that's what you are. I want the gold. I also want to get around you. A dude with a shield, hello. Oh, I knocked the shield out of his hand. That's kind of cool. I've got a long way to go to the next level. So we're just going to make a beeline to um, the chest up here, which it looks like we're getting close to because it moves quite a lot as we're walking towards it. So There it is the chest and we get some equipment so from here we can choose boots for defense 100 pickup range of five percent health capacity or increase the base critical damage i think i'm going to take this one thank you very much now we've got a, oh out 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 we've got a boss or a champion or whatever they want to be called in this game we don't have a huge amount of damage dealt so as long as we stay out of his way we should be okay but i'm going to try and break down this fire thing here and have him walk through it worked out all right actually i only did about a quarter of his damage though so uh, i've got a long way to go yet boom right 10 percent damage base health base defense do you know what that's not bad actually we'll take that i know it doesn't make me kill quicker but it makes me survive longer so i'm happy with that ouch that's a like slime thing got me come on let's do some serious damage to this dude there's some XP down here, which we're going to wander towards. 
I can get this guy, kill him. I'm thinking I might get a relic or something, or a, some sort of artifact. I haven't actually seen the death of one of these yet, so I don't know. I like the criticals. Criticals are nice. There we go. Right, we get an ability. Okay, so a lightning strike, phantom needles, or astronomer's orbs. I kind of like the idea of phantom needles. There we go. There's our secondary attack. That's actually quite nice. They're low damage, but they're high enough that it uh, makes me feel a bit more confident. Ouch. Gotta keep trying to survive for the moment. Okay, we've got quests. Well, oh. Right, some XP. Um, base health is fine. I think I'm going to take this one. Plus 3% base critical hit chance. Don't know if there's a way I can. Indeed, right. So my base critical hit chance is 11% now. It's not great, but I was already doing quite a few, so I'm happy with that. Little needles are quite good. I'd like to get a second level of that if I can. I don't know if you can get levels. I would certainly be interested. Trying to hit the fire. Lovely. Right, so the fire did quite a bit there, but I'm going to have to... Just make my way down here. Another level. Um, all regen? No, more damage. Certainly helps. We're going to ignore the fire for the moment. Now we go over there. Oh, what are you? Ah, little impy things. Go away. Right. Let's just go down this way. 192 on a crit now is quite nice. I have to be able to get that over 200 at some point. Well, they make a sound, don't they? <laughs> uh, right, okay, I'm going to get surrounded in a second, so let's go over here. Some fire. Have another level. 10% attack speed? Ooh. No, we take that one. That's nice. Over 200 now on a crit, which I really like. The noises. So, so far, really simplistic. But that's not a bad thing, because it does what it does very well. It feels like if Vampire Survivors was made in the mid-90s. And I kind of like it. Have some fire, have some hit stuff. 6% um, movement. Take some base defense, I think. I have a feeling I'm going to be taking some damage soon. Too many enemies. Too many enemies. Ow, 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 ow. The regen is very good, I'm not going to lie. But I'm getting hit too many times. There's another... Ah! Right, I have no dash or anything, so I've got to be careful. I'm just going to try and focus him from a distance. I see ya. Okay. He is extremely close. Have some fire. I mean, I hit him. Ouch. Let me get this uh, ability thing, I think it is. Right, so arcane splinters, short range projectiles in a vertical spread pattern. Okay. Lightning strike or astronomer's orb. I think I'm going to take the lightning strike. Because I know what to expect from that. They're not massively uh, fast or quick acting, but it's okay. There is another level. Um, base block chance. Needle firing speed and range is good. But I'm going to take normal range for me. Now, what hit me then? This guy may not be defeated on my first go. I'm not going to lie. I will do my best though. I'm getting loads of experience from uh, stuff that's dropping around me, which is good. Uh, let's go 10% attack speed. My damage is still quite low. Could do with just a, like a small damage increase. Doesn't even need to be much. Um, 
That's not bad. All right, we'll take that. Don't know if that's going to be what I need, but I'll take it. 200,000 damage in one run. Yeah, all right. That <laughs> didn't feel like that, but okay. Right, so come on. Uh. Just survive. That's all I've got to do. Right, more regen. No, we'll go for the... Uh, 8% area. Ow. We're almost at another level. So that seems to do some damage, which is quite nice. Uh, let's take the needle firing speed. We defeated the Imp Chieftain. Cool. Right, I just need to get his stuff now. Excuse me, Mr. Shieldy boys. We don't like you anymore. You may die now. We have to kite you away for a bit, aren't I? Okay. Hopefully that stays on the screen if I don't get too far away. We blow them all away. Oh, there's more. There's magic people. What's going on? Right, so we've got uh, copper ring, base critical damage, 10% movement speed, 20% attack speed. Uh, oh, hang on. Right, let's cancel that for the moment. No, 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 no. Oh, it's not letting me do that. Right. Ah, yeah, so they are... Okay, so let's take copper, and then let's run away, because I'm in damage area. Okay, I just, just want some damage. Is that minus 10% damage overall, or is that minus 10% damage on just the lightnings? I'm going to have to risk it. I'd rather have double the uh, lightnings and, and slightly less damage, I think. Yeah, I think it is just damage on the lightning, so that's fine. Oh, ow. Magic balls. Leave me alone. Right, so let's see if we can carry on and hopefully not die. The fireballs are risky, but I can avoid them at the moment. And now it's off the screen. Uh, let's get some XP down here. Loads. Quite a way off a level, though. He says, plus 10% damage, plus 75 base damage on the lightning strike. Yeah, we take that. Right. I need to get more lightning strikes. Because the lightning's there. Uh, was that 577 damage from a lightning strike? Or was that me? That is 577 damage. We need to get more lightning immediately. Okay. Um, okay. Fox, yeah, we'll take that. It's fine. A little bit speedier now. I like it. I like the little plinky sounds you make as you pick stuff up. That's quite nice. Right, come on. Let's kill this dude down here. Thank you. Kill the big metallic slimes now. Oh, they split into little ones. That's actually... That causes me some sort of panic for some reason. Hello, we've got another boss, dude. Okay. Uh, I think... Was 15% damage? Yeah, we'll take that. I wonder what my criticals are now. It's not bad. 293. I'll take it. The lightnings are very, very nice. That's another level very soon. Oh, I was hoping to get there a bit quicker than that. Ow. Yeah. Take all that damage. Right. 8% uh, range, defense, 10% damage. Over 300 on a crit now, which is very nice. I'd love to get a crit on my lightning. That'll be it. Or just awesome. Right, come on. Am I going to be able to kill this skeletal swordsman thing? Ouch. I've got fairly decent health at the moment, which is fine. But if I get a couple of hits like that, 
that's going to quickly uh, evaporate. Uh, let's go... Do you know what? Let's take 10% attack speed then. Increases my DPS, not necessarily my damage, but that's okay. Just slowly kiting around the outside of these guys. Just to slowly collect all their XP, basically. Um, ball regen? Yeah. Out of the way. Leave me alone. There is loads of XP around, which is quite nice. I'm not sure what I'm going to be using this gold for, but I'm imagining it's going to be some sort of meta currency, maybe? Because I don't have a shop, do I? Hello, doggies. I don't like the doggies. Oh, the doggies are bad. Oh, no, 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 no. Bad, bad, bad. Yeah, okay, so I don't have any dash. I don't know if that's because of the build I'm playing as, or just I don't have it. Right, there's another level. 15% um, attack speed, yes. Right, I am slowly regening some health. We've got green slimes now. The, the bear dog things are upsetting. I need everything through the fire if I can. Ah. Okay, green slimes also leave poison on the floor by the looks of it. I don't know if they're poisonous to everything or just to me. I don't want to test it, but let's find out. Yeah, it's poisonous to me. Okay. Uh, we're going to go 10% attack speed again. I'd really like some damage now. I'm not going to lie. The damage would be fantastic if I could get some. Similarly, survival would be nice. But I can't guarantee that either. Come on. My movement speed is just on the borderline of where I need to be at the moment. Right. Oh, heck. Don't go towards them. There's some fire. Have that. That actually helped quite a bit. Oh, boy. Right. 20% um, charge speed minus 20% critical damage is not bad. I'm going to take that. So more lightning, again more DPS. We are in an okay place. We've killed a lot of enemies. Oh heck, I've got two bosses now. Where did the... Oh, I've only knocked his shield out of his hand. I've got 140 odd health. This boss looks impossible. He's almost dead. Ouch. I'm almost dead. Let me get your ability. We'll take Arcane Splinters. Don't know what it does, but I'm going to take it and run the heck away. Right. Um, Except range. 10% range on my weapon and 3% block chance. Sounds all right. That's the Arcane Splinters, the spinning shuriken things on the floor. They're not amazing, which is why I've left them until most last. The astronomer's orbs are even worse. <laughs> I've already seen those. Um, yeah. So now it's just survive until my 100 odd health runs out. Oh, I'm in a bad place. 75 health. Right. Can I have some more XP? Yes. 10% range and 15% code width. Yeah, we'll take that. Ooh. Okie dokie then. One arcane splitter. Critical damage bonus. We'll take that. We have a second one. 5,000 meters in one run as well. Nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. We'll take 8% range. Leave me alone. If I can beat this one, I will be very surprised because this is the only other boss I've seen now. Everything else is new. 147 health. I 
You know what? Attacking me like that is not fair. No. Right. Uh, metabolism? No. Let's go more arcane splitters. Maybe I should have taken them earlier. Maybe I should not die. Ah. I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to kill this guy because I can't get close enough to him safely. Oh, he's throwing loads of shield dudes at me. Just got to try and break around. That was sneaky. Um, no. Don't like that. A long way to go to my next level. Oh, got it. Right, okay. 10% um, attack speed. 10% splinter range and plus 5 splinter base damage. We'll take that. Yeah, the splinters actually aren't too bad. I didn't think they were very good when I first saw them. Well, they seem to do enough damage. Oh, I'm in a bad way there. I like the uh, the visual thing of knocking a shield out of uh, the uh, skeleton's hands. And it makes the uh, the attacks I'm doing feel a little bit more consequential. Okay, I see ya. Right, walk through the fire. There we go. I'll ignore the fact that I've only got 130 health. Stay alive. Tiny, tiny bit longer. Okay, another level. Right. Plus 10% damage could be quite good. I think I'll take it. Just raw output of damage. Oh, bad. I haven't seen any XP gain bonuses yet. Be interesting to see if there's such a thing in the game. Oh, more doggies. Good. That's just what I wanted. Uh, 38 health. Nope. I've got nowhere to go. 40 health. So many enemies. And there's another boss. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Um, I got to level 31, which is quite nice. Don't mind that too much. Let's carry on. So, we've now unlocked three statues, and we get another hero. However, this one we might use same for another video. We have quests. We have the Register of Halls, which I'm guessing is kind of my previous runs. And we have a Shrine of Blessing, where you can... Spend your gold like I thought I could. Right, 598 gold. We'll probably deal with that on the next video. I'm just going to check what these other two things do. There's another statue there as well. Ah, so these are your levels. Okay. And this one here is your... Oh. Oh, I like it. Ah, okay. Right, cool, cool, cool. Right, okay, well, we'll leave that there. This is Halls of Torment, I believe it's called. Let me just double check. Oh, my word. How bad is that? It is. It's called Halls of Torment, and it is the demo. Uh, you can check this out with the link down in the description, uh, just underneath that subscribe button. Uh, again, like I say, it's like Diablo 2 for me meets um, Vampire Survivors, and I'm here for it. Definitely, I'll be wishlisting this, and I believe the full version of the game comes out very soon, if not already. Let me check. No, it's not out yet. Um, so if you want to go check it out, of course, uh, you can go wishlist it down below. There's uh, plenty of time for development to uh, proceed as well, because it's quarter two, 2023, which we are about to enter, believe it or not. Um, and if you want to see that, of course, you can join the channel down below and uh, follow along with its progress. Other than that, I'm Dark Shadow Plays, and I will see you very soon.